semifinals kick off with a rivalry that rules them all. Duke is led by ACC Offensive Player of the Year, Michelle Cooper, and ACC Freshman of the Year, Kat Rader. North Carolina won a share of the regular season title and is on the hunt for, you ready for this Tar Heel fans? ACC Championship number 23. It's Duke and Carolina next. And we're off. Blue Devils in their signature blue, white shorts, and North Carolina in their signature Carolina blue. Emily Moxley from the corner. Second of the match for the Tar Heels, punched away by Jones. Back in the box there for the taking, but out of bounds. As this match plays out tonight. Patterson had an opening, takes her shot, and Luthie Jones handles it cleanly. First 15, 20 minutes of this game, no need to foul there. Migley, it's time to serve. She does, gets it through. Cooper makes her way into the goal. Ball didn't quite get there. Emmy Allen, alert. He Pierce playing that lone holding midfield rule for the Tar Heels. Now Patterson gets herself a look. Yeah. Or getting it at her feet, as we've just seen the last few attacks for North Carolina. But yes, ultimately, to have a shot from 20 yards out on Ruthie Jones will take it all day. There's another one. That one a bit more dangerous, though. They don't want to take that all day. <laughs> Listen, we always North Carolina ready from the corner flag. Hansen searching for it. Got there, but so too did Jones. We're seeing North Carolina get numbers behind, denying Michelle Cooper that early ball. Chico, nobody stepping up to stop. Eventually, she just takes a shot herself. And it's a good spell of possession for the Duke Blue Devils, just to move it side to side, looking to see if they can find that moment to be able to play in between the lines. Cooper got some space. A little too far out to be too dangerous. Are you a little surprised to see? Well, hold on now. I was gonna say that we're scoreless. We are still, this will be a foul about midfield and a card it looks like maybe coming out, hold on. Ashley Cedro trying to get everybody under control. She is given a straight red. Ball in to Michelle Cooper for her to be able to make the play. Ball does stay in right at the end line. Now in the box, a chance for a shot. There it is, and just wide. Well, Cooper had been marking Hanson. She's not out there at the moment for Duke. Hanson got her head to it, and it is saved off the line. Actually, I think that was Gambone. Who does so well, just gets down low, keeps it on frame, and exactly what you want your post player to do, just stand up, goes off the chest of Delaney Graham, it looks like, in such an important role, delivering balls in from a bit deeper areas. This looks like we'll see another card on the play as one of the few moments Duke had to break out. L. Piper was fouled on the play, and then Talia Della Peruta, that is actually her second yellow, so she's now out of the match. You gotta be smarter than that. In her Duke career, grad student, three-time All-ACC as Cooper has some numbers, goes to her right, just out of the reach of Raider. Meza couldn't get the contact she wanted. And so overtime <laughs> it is between Duke and North Carolina for a spot in the ACC final. Still continue to find the wide areas and then find more opportunities to deliver balls in that can cause North Carolina some problems in the box. Like this right here. This is a great start for North Carolina. What a shot, Patterson. Colton just knocked off the ball. Jenna Royson knows where she wants to go to the ACC Offensive Player of the Year. Now the freshman of the year, Kat Rader. Can these two create a winning combination for Duke? Rader back to her left. It did get blocked on the way in. Finds Patterson. Avery Patterson, leading scorer for the Tar Heels on the season, does get herself a look this time in front of the goal. Ruthie Jones, quick reaction. 
actions, keeping the ball out of the back of the net. For the Duke Blue Devils, and then it's Cooper and Raider up top. Shell Cooper tries, decides to try her luck. Willing to pick up that second ball. Patterson still going strong for the Tar Heels. She'll take her shot, it's off the post! Does this semifinal match come down to this? Sophie Jones for Duke, looking for the corner, punched away by Allen. For that free kick opportunity here is Sophie Jones. 10 second countdown is on. Blue Devils with numbers. L. Piper shot, too high. We will be headed to the shootout to determine our first participant in Sunday's ACC championship. The first player up for Duke. Getting ready to line up with the left foot. We'll see how she starts off the Blue Devils. Saved! Boy, Ruthie Jones got a piece of it. She knew she just about had it, but it does give North Carolina the advantage. She's up next for Duke. Dewar got it this time. Duke on the board. <laughs> Rachel Jones, and once again, Ruthie Jones finds the ball the hand but just can't keep it out Raider now for the Blue Devils trying to keep pace at their first one saved Raider gets another more pressure less pressure here as they have the advantage their keeper made the save Duke needs one of those they haven't gotten it so far Ali Sittner now keeping the Tar Heels a perfect three for three for the Blue Devils at the spot Lynch gets it. <laughs> Patterson gets the corner. North Carolina still perfect. Down to Michelle Cooper, the ACC Offensive Player of the Year. Must convert here for Duke to have hope. Emmy Allen saved the first one she faced. Deep breath from Cooper. Find in the corner. Calm as you please. Bella Sembert trying to win it for North Carolina. Save! Ruthie Jones coming up with the save her team needed to stay alive. Piper giving the blue down the lead in the shootout. Now it is North Carolina who must answer. For the Tar Heels, has to make it, or Duke's moving on. Della Rose did her job. Jones, that corner's been good to the Blue Devils. <laughs> to continue. Grant versus Jones. Got her hand there again. Boy, Ruthie Jones has been good, but not quite good enough to stop. This is round eight of the shootout. Save! Allen gives her team a chance to win it. Moxley in the moment sends North Carolina. 